Hey guys, uh, I just found out what kind of spike this is. This is actually the 316 stainless steel, and it actually is 316 stainless steel, but that ain't that ain't the case. This stainless steel railroad spike was made by the CEO of Illinois Central Railroad in 1929, when the 2600 and 2613 was built from the ground up in Paducah, Kentucky. Well, here's the real part about the railroad spike. This is actually the 1929 last spike for Paducah, Kentucky Railroad. What this was, this is the original Illinois Central Railroad spike that's made of stainless steel to be the last spike. So the CEO of Illinois Central Railroad made this railroad spike out of 316 stainless steel in 1929 right after 2613 and 2600 was built and Paducah, Kentucky. Well, here's the main thing. Back in 1929, they had the road fair in Paducah, Kentucky, and they wanted to make the reenact the 1869 of the, the last spike ceremony. So what they done, 1929, the last spike was made in Paducah, Kentucky for the last spike ceremony of Illinois Central Railroad. But what they did, 2613 and 2600 were face to face together in the middle of Paducah, Kentucky. And he did the Thank God Unite the to, to Two, Unite the Two Railroads of Illinois Central Railroad. Unites the, unites the, the two, the railroad with America in 1929. And this thing that still spike was hitting the ground on May 10th, 1929. So, yeah. So what they did, he's like, thank God for Unite America with Illinois Central Railroad. They unite the, the railroad in America of the world. Then the railroad spike was smacked into the track. In 1929 and everybody was clapping and everything else so this one here was it this one here is the real original last spike of Illinois Central Railroad as you can see there's the diamond for Illinois Central and it's got the IC right here and it's got the HC so what the CEO did he used a, a normal regular iron spike made the mold out of that and poured the mold Poured the stainless steel on the mold, and he made this last spike in 19 for the 1929 World's Fair. So, yep, for the last spike ceremony in 1929. So, if anybody has any questions on this railroad spike, uh, you let me know, and I'll get you guys loaded. Okay, I will see you later.